All right, so today we are taking on the newest infinite Dragon Ball history stage on global, which is stage 21 versus sworn enemies from the future. Now, as much as possible, we try to clear all the missions in one run just to save some time, right? And in order to do that for this stage, we have to bring three units from the Future Saga category and three units from the Bond of Parent and Child category. Now, of course, for Future Saga, we're good to go since this is a full Future Saga team. And for Bond of Parent and Child, we have the Fizz Future Gohan, the Int Future Gohan, and also the Tech Future Teen Trunks. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. As you can see, we do have a rainbow, uh, LR Trunks and Vegeta as the friend. And uh, my leader is the Fizz Future Gohan because I don't want to spoil the summoning video from this morning and uh, reveal whether I got the new Trunks and Vegeta, right? So feel free to go check out that summoning video. I'll put a link somewhere over my head for that. So. Yeah, turn one, we're facing the tech androids, and we have the uh, friend Trunks and Vegeta, as well as the LR Gohan and Trunks. So let's give these guys some orbs. We should be able to take them out uh, with this one rotation. Uh, let me see, 202k defense for the Trunks and Vegeta, 162k for the Gohan and Trunks. And uh, we're basically going to be floating the tech Trunks because... He's not going to be doing much for us here. Uh, he's mainly here for the Bond of Parent and Child category. He can be pretty decent defensively still, but he really needs an easy A at this point. Uh, I hope he does get a Shreem Z Awakening soon, because uh, his damage is very outdated. Anyways, uh, Trunks and Vegeta for Super. Pretty good. Additional Super. The androids should definitely be dead now. There we go. Okay, not bad. Oh, there's also another mission uh, with a turn restriction. And I think we have to clear this stage within... Was it... How many turns? Oh, 18 turns. I think it's 18 turns. So let's do... Um... Okay, so I want to keep the Fizz, Future Gohan, and the AGL Trunks together but they don't share key links, which is a problem. So maybe we have to do this. That might be the move. Okay, so let's put Vegito Blue in the first slot for the counters. And then we can give a super to the future Gohan. And uh, I guess we'll float the AGL trunks for now. Okay, that's not good. That's gonna hurt. Yeah, all right. I was kind of hoping that this could be a no item run, but taking a super like that early on is uh, gonna make that really difficult. It's gonna make it really hard to not use any items, especially in the later stages because I know that the Fusion Zamasu hits pretty damn hard. So yeah, this might not be a no item run guys, so I apologize. I know you guys are disappointed to me you know like I should definitely be doing this with no items but uh it is what it is it is what it is okay second fight down we're making good time uh it's only turn three right only turn three and we're already on the third enemy so we're definitely on track to beat this within 18 turns and we got the active skill already but I'm not gonna pop it we're saving that for probably the last phase so let's just give these guys an 18 key super that's gonna be a 24 key super for the gohan and trunks and a lot of int orbs for the int future gohan as well not bad not bad there's oh okay I thought there would be a third uh, attack from the Trunks and Vegeta, but that's okay. They're still tanking really well. Um, they are one of the best slot one defenders in the game with uh, the guard, with the 
stacking up defense. Like by the end of this event, they should be ridiculously, ridiculously tanky. In fact, if they take a super from like the Fusion Zamasu boss, I'm pretty sure they would take double digits. I'd be surprised if it was more than like 100 damage at most. We'll see. Hopefully it happens. But yeah, um, really good unit, guys. Really, really good unit. Okay, so we got 70k defense for the Vegito Blue, but he does have type advantage, so it might be okay to keep him the first slot. Although, I do want to also have Trunks and Gohan together. Yeah, let's do the Trunks and Gohan rotation. Yeah, and we'll float the Vegito Blue. Because we're making such good time on the 18 turns that I don't think we need all that damage from Vegito Blue. At least I don't think we do. Yeah, we, we should be fine. I might end up regretting this decision, actually, but it's okay. It's okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Tech Trunks needs a lot more turns to, uh, to, to continue stacking up, clearly. So we got lucky that none of those attacks were supers, because if we had taken a super attack there, I think it would have been over. I'm pretty yeah, I'm 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 a hundred percent sure it would have been over. Cause even Vegito Blue with two supers and type advantage took over 100 k So that was dangerous, guys. That was uh, that was a dangerous game. But we survived. I'm still not gonna pop an item because I know that this rotation is gonna do just fine. It's not a big deal. But the other rotation, we definitely have to be careful um, with, because uh, those guys are not the best defensively. Um, it would definitely have helped if we had a second Trunks and Vegeta as my leader. But once again, maybe I have them, maybe I don't. Only one way to find out. <laughs> Only one way to find out. Go check out the video. Okay, so Rose, I think, should be killed by my Trunks if he does get some additional supers, which he usually does. He usually does. There we go. Okay, so if this super crits, I think he should die. If not, then he might survive with like a little bit of HP. Oh, that's annoying. <laughs> that's so annoying. That's basically you know, a, a wasted turn right there. That's a wasted turn right there. Ah, <sighs> okay. Still, 18 turns. Four more fights. I think this is the fourth fight. So yeah, four more fights from here. Making good progress. Or maybe this is the fifth fight. This might be the fifth fight, actually. No, sixth? I don't know, man. I lost count. I lost count. Doesn't matter. Um, Let's put them in the first slot. Vegito Blue at the end. Taking a super would be a bad time. Okay, so this is where we pop the Icarus. I didn't want to have to use an item this early, but I feel like it's it's just safe. Um to do that in case yeah Vegito Blue takes a super I think he would probably die unless we get like four supers off with the Vegito Blue which almost never happens so I'm not gonna count on that a couple of additional attacks from the Trunks and Vegeta and they're taking the super which is awesome 54 damage I think even with no items they would have taken probably double digits I would guess. Obviously, I haven't had too much time with this unit. They just came out, so I can't say for sure, but their defense is, is legit, guys. It's, it's the real deal. I'm not saying they're the best defender in the game. You know, that's um, probably... I mean, I was going to say AGL Golden Frieza, but AGL Golden Frieza, I mean, he has a lot of damage reduction, but he doesn't get any defense. So I don't really know if he would actually be the best defender with his damage reduction. 
gotta look into it gotta look into it anyways um amazing tanking <laughs> amazing tanking and on this turn um i think we should be fine putting tech trunks in the first slot so that we can get a super off with the is gohan and then agl trunks i guess we'll just you know chill in that third slot at this point this guy should have over 200k defense and then with the icarus active definitely over 200k defense and with the icarus i think he can take a super now maybe hopefully okay we're not getting supered anyways and then the uh fizz gohan as you guys know gets a ton of damage reduction so he should be okay he should definitely be okay taking a super there we go all right so turn eight down we still have 10 turns uh this is definitely the second last fight i know that so we have two more fights with 10 turns to go i think we got it i think we got it mm, okay so that uh future gohan in the third slot concerns me he does concern me but there's only one attack there's only one attack so in theory we should be fine right <laughs> watch me die with a super oh we're good okay there's no super there but it would have been both hilarious and tragic if that last attack was a super and we just died um it would be something that happens to me because my luck as a whole in dokkan for the last couple of months has not been great so i wouldn't have uh i wouldn't have complained i would have just accepted it you know that's just my fate in this game but did you guys see how much damage you took from that super and there's no item active anymore. You know, we we lost the Icarus, so that was just pure passive tanking. And it's super impressive. I mean, guard with over 500k defense um, is hard to is hard to break through. You know, uh, really only like Cell Max third phase will do damage to you. And even then, they are one of the best defenders against Cell Max. They make Cell Max. Maybe not not a joke, but definitely a lot more manageable. If you guys have been struggling with Cell Max and you got the Trunks and Vegeta, um, give them a shot because they should definitely help a, a ton with that stage. Okay, back to full health. Um, normally I would. Normally, I would worry about the tech trunks, but I don't think we have to because we got type advantage with the Fizz Future Gohan. He should kill him. If not, then Vegito Blue should finish the job. But most likely, I think Future Gohan will get it done. Yeah, all right, all right, last phase. Um, I'm actually going to, I'm gonna play it safe. Let's go for a Whis here. And we'll give these orbs to Vegeta and Trunks, these to Gohan and Trunks. And then, you know what, screw it. Yo, let's transform future Gohan because I haven't seen this guy's active skill animation in ages so I think it's just time I think it's time for us to see Trunks' first ever Super Saiyan transformation and we cannot get a super off <laughs> well that's awesome that's awesome Uh, maybe he'll get an additional super.
Nice. Oh wait, why didn't I pop? I should have popped the Trunks and Medita active skill. Hopefully we make we make it back to this rotation so that we get another chance because I totally forgot to, to use that active skill. Hmm. Additional super for Trunks and Gohan. Uh, we still got seven turns, which I think will be enough to kill this guy. I, I think I think we'll just make it. I think we'll just make it. Additional normal, no super, and of course he's the one to take a super attack. Of course he's the one to take a super attack. Oh god. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Okay. Um. So I can say with confidence that the, the item was a good idea. I can say confidently the item was a good idea. <laughs> oh my god. Taking normals for 70k? Are you kidding me? That's just dumb. Ash is dumb. Well, at least now we have the double Whis effect, so there's no chance that we we die here. Um, but yeah, that was crazy. That was crazy. Guys, don't take Fusions of Master too lightly, okay? He's he's not playing around. He's not playing around. I think Trunks and Vegeta could have taken that super though for like double digits, no problem. But um. You know, your your normal units will take some punishment, as you just saw. As you just saw. Although, I think it's also my fault. Um, if I had kept Trunks untransformed, he would have been able to probably get a couple of supers off. And, you know, stack his defense a little bit. And, uh... Oh, is this going to be bad? This might be bad, too. Oh, never mind. Okay, we're good. <laughs> we're good. And now it's all over. Enjoy the father son Gallic gun, guys. Because that's going to be the final attack of the run. It's only fitting that these guys, you know, being the MVP of the run, being the MVP of the team, get the uh, last attack as well. Ah, <sighs> what a unit, man. What a unit. Their damage, of course, is not the highest we've seen, but the defense, the defense is incredible. And they do more than enough damage that, like, yeah, they're awesome. <laughs> it's awesome unit. Awesome, awesome unit. This wasn't really a showcase of Trunks and Vegeta, not a proper one at least, because we don't have, like, double 200% leads, but it kind of was, too. It kind of was too, because you guys were able to see just how impressive this unit can be, even without double 200% leaders, so they could have been even better than what you saw here if I had a second Trunks and Vegeta as the leader. But uh, anyways guys, that's going to do it for the video. We, I think, cleared all the missions. Let me just collect them, make sure that we didn't miss any. And uh, good luck in your runs as well. Um... There we go. Yeah, 252 for 252, 23 stones. Easy work. And uh, that's it, guys. That's going to be the video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger. With Tiger, Uppercut Media, signing out.